Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to review a couple of electric sharpeners from CNASA. They were kind enough to send me some of their products to try out. This is not a sponsored video of any kind. I just thought I will share my thoughts on these two models with you guys. In a previous video, I mentioned how a sharpener with a helical blade is superior to usual sharpeners having flat blades. Helical blade sharpeners usually last longer than the flat blades and they don't tend to break the pencils while sharpening. Many hand cranked sharpeners and electric sharpeners carry a helical blade. I usually use a manual sharpener with a helical blade to sharpen my pencils, especially Prismacolor pencils because they tend to break very easily with normal sharpeners. I never had a chance to use an electric sharpener before because they are not available to purchase in my country. But then people from Sinasa approached me and offered some electric pencil sharpeners for reviewing. I was really happy to get them and show you guys how they performed. I got two models from them. First one has a small form factor and we hold the pencil vertically to sharpen. It turns on automatically when the pencil is inserted and stops automatically once the pencil is fully sharpened. So there is no need to worry about over sharpening or wasting the pencils. This is the simpler one of the two and I have seen a lot of models like this from various videos. Nothing fancy here, just put the pencil in and you get a nice sharp point within seconds. It runs with an adapter plugged into the wall or it can run from batteries. This is convenient because we can use these sharpness while traveling also. I think this is perfect for Prismacolor pencil users because they fit perfectly and chance of breakage or splitting is very rare. I have been using this sharpener for over 2 weeks now and I never had a breakage with them. So for Prismacolor or Polychromos lovers, these sharpeners are perfect. And this model doesn't cost you much too. It is just around $1.16 on Amazon. I have put the links for both these sharpeners below. The only drawback of this model is that they can't be used with thicker pencils like Derwent pencils or Caran Dash luminance. This sharpener is designed to sharpen pencils only up to 8mm in diameter. I think I'll use this model most of the time because I mostly use Prismacolor for my drawings. The second model is different in many ways. I was actually surprised to see how this model sharpened pencils. I have never seen such sharpeners anywhere before because it has a special pencil loading mechanism. It's bigger and heavier compared to the previous model. We have to load the pencil horizontally. We just have to put the pencil inside. It will automatically pull the pencil in, sharpen it completely and expel the pencils after sharpening. It is completely hand free. This is very easy on the hands. We put the pencil in and we get a completely sharpened pencil out. This way we can even sharpen little stumps of pencils because of the auto expelling. And we can use many different pencils also. I could sharpen both Caran Dash Luminance and Derwent pencils with this one. The only drawback is since it is fully automatic we cannot sharpen the pencil halfway because we can't really pull the pencils while sharpening. This particular model also runs with an adapter plugged into the wall. I really like this model of sharpener because of its particular way of sharpening. But I think I'll use the first one more frequently because I use Prismacolor pencils most of the time and sometimes I need less sharpened ends for burnishing. So this was a brief review of both these models of electric sharpeners from CNASA. I am so happy to try them out and I am quite satisfied with both these products. I have put the links below if you want to purchase them. I am sure you won't regret buying these. Thank you so much for watching this video. In case you have any doubts regarding these products, feel free to ask me on Insta or Facebook. All the links are given below.